Okay, so uh, on, on the microscope controls, you can see the big knob and small knobs. On the big knob, uh, we can adjust the focus uh, roughly, and using the small knob, we can finely tune it. Also, we can use the stage controls, so the upper ring moves the stage in the Y direction, and the lower one moves it on the X axis. You could also see the objectives, so uh, we can rotate them to change the objective. And the maximum objective uh, with, with air uh, is 40x, and to use the 100x we need to use oil immersion. Okay, so now we are going to drop an oil on the slide so that we can use the 100x. So we lower the stage to the maximum, place our sample, and then change the objective to our 100x. Then we place the drop right behind, uh, beneath the objective and start, under the control of eyes, we start rotating the big knob until we see the clear touching of the surface of the oil with the objective. And you could clearly see that, like here. Now you go a little back and start working with the small knob. Now you work with the small knob. Here you can see the single yeast cells. You can also use the uh, stage control to find the best views of yourself for yourself. And as you can see, they both retained violet and pink staining. Now to remove the sample, we again lower the stage to the maximum, remove our sample, place the sample with uh, Staphylococcus aureus, drop one oil, Place one oil drop on it, then place the this drop beneath the objective and under the control of your eyes, we start elevating the stage. And when this objective and drop touched each other, we, using the big knob, we go a little lower and then start working with the small knob.
Okay, so when we're focused, we can use the stage controls to find the uh, best view for ourselves and then try to uh, draw these cells in your notebook. Now they are stained purple and this means that it is gram positive cells. Okay, so when you finished, again using the big knob, just lower the stage so that you can safely remove uh, the, the sample. And after that, place new sample. In this case, we are going to use the Asherica coli. drop oil on top of it. And again, under the control of your eyes, place the oil drop right under the objective and start using the big knob to touch the oil with the objective. When you see the moment of touching, go a little down with the big knob and then using your uh, fine tuning, find the cells. Okay, now you can see the cells and they look like the small roads. And they are very small. And as you can see here, they are really in the shape of roads. And you can find bigger colonies single ones like here just find the best view for yourself and draw them in your notebook Finally we have the bacterial mix and we are going to use immersion oil also and then we switch to the next part of the lab which is finding the tissues of the human body.
Okay, so now you see the uh, the cells, and you use the horizontal switch to find the cells that look like rows and look like bubbles. And both of them should be present, and both of them should be stained as gram positive and gram negative cells. So here you can see the roads and the bubbles. And this is the mix of bacteria. As you can see here, we are moving closer and closer so you can find small details and finally when we get to the place of the focus to the plane of the focus we can switch to the small knob and start focusing on the details we can also use uh, the stage controllers so the upper will move it in the y direction and smaller one will move it in the x direction Now you can see that our cells are stained with a methylene blue and they have a distinct cell wall and we can distinguish between these cells and actually we have a single layer of the cells in this onion skin.